The Norsemen or Norse people were the North Germanic peoples of the early Middle Ages, during which they spoke Old Norse language and practiced Old Norse religion. The language belongs to the North Germanic branch of the Indo-European languages and is the predecessor of the modern Germanic languages of Scandinavia. During the late 8th century, Norsemen embarked on a large-scale expansion in all directions, giving rise to the Viking Age. In English language scholarship since the 19th century, Norse seafaring traders, settlers and warriors have commonly been referred to as Vikings. Though lacking a common ethnonym, the Viking Age Norsemen still had a common identity, which survives among their modern descendants, the Danes, Icelanders, Faroe Islanders, Norwegians and Swedes, who are now generally referred to as Scandinavians, rather than Norsemen. Topic. History of the terms Norsemen and Northmen The word Norseman first appears in English during the early 19th century. The earliest attestation given in the third edition of the Oxford English Dictionary is from Walter Scott's 1817 Herald the Dauntless. The word was coined using the adjective Norse, which was borrowed into English from Dutch during the 16th century with the sense Norwegian, and which by Scott's time had acquired the sense of or relating to Scandinavia or its language, especially Eshali, in ancient or medieval times. As with modern use of the word Viking, therefore, the word Norseman has no particular basis in medieval usage. The term Norseman does echo terms meaning Northmen, applied to Norse speakers by the peoples they encountered during the Middle Ages. The Old Frankish word Nortman, Northman, was Latinized as Normanus and was widely used in Latin texts. The Latin word Normanus then entered Old French as Normans. From this word came the name of the Normans and of Normandy, which was settled by Norsemen in the 10th century. The same word entered Hispanic languages and local varieties of Latin with forms beginning not only in N, but in L, such as Lordomani, apparently reflecting nasal dissimulation in local Romance languages. This form may in turn have been borrowed into Arabic. The prominent early Arabic source Al Masudi identified the 844 raiders on Seville not only as Rus but also Al Ladana. <laughs> Other names In modern scholarship, Vikings is a common term for attacking Norsemen, especially in connection with raids and monastic plundering by Norsemen in the British Isles, but it was not used in this sense at the time. In Old Norse and Old English, the word simply meant pirate. The Norse were also known as Askamani, Ashman, by the Germans, Lachlanic, Norse, by the Gaels, and Dean, Danes, by the Anglo Saxons. The Gaelic terms Finn Gaul, Norwegian Viking or Norwegian, Dub Gaul, Danish Viking or Danish, and Gaul Goidel, foreign Gaelic, were used for the people of Norse descent in Ireland and Scotland, who assimilated into the Gaelic culture. Dubliners called them Ostmen, or East People, and the name Oxmanstown, an area in central Dublin, the name is still current, comes from one of their settlements, they were also known as Lachlanai, or Lake People. The Slavs, the Arabs and the Byzantines knew them as the Rus or Rose, Rose probably derived from various uses of Rose, i.e., related to rowing or from the area of Roslagen in east-central Sweden, where most of the Vikings who visited the Slavic lands originated. Archaeologists and historians of today believe that these Scandinavian settlements in the Slavic lands formed the names of the countries of Russia and Belarus. The Slavs and the Byzantines also called them Varangians Old Norse, Varingyar, meaning sworn men, and the Scandinavian bodyguards of the Byzantine emperors were known as the Varangian Guard. Topic. Modern Scandinavian usage In the Old Norse language, the term Noroanir men northern people was used correspondingly to the modern English name Norsemen, referring to Swedes, Danes, Norwegians, Faroe Islanders, Icelanders, and others. Modern Scandinavian languages have a common word for Norsemen, the word Nordbo, Swedish, Nordborna, Danish, Nordborn, Norwegian, Nordborn, or Nordbuane in the definite plural, is used for both ancient and modern people living in the Nordic countries and speaking one of the Scandinavian Germanic languages. <laughs> 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 
Topic: Geography. The British conception of the Vikings' origins was inaccurate. Those who plundered Britain lived in what is today Denmark, Scania, the western coast of Sweden and Norway up to almost the 70th parallel and along the Swedish Baltic coast up to around the 60th latitude and Lake Malaren. They also came from the island of Gotland, Sweden. The border between the Norsemen and more southerly Germanic tribes, the Danerverk, today is located about 50 kilometers 31 miles south of the Danish-German border. The southernmost living Vikings lived no further north than Newcastle upon Tyne, and traveled to Britain more from the east than from the north. The northern part of the Scandinavian peninsula with the exception of the Norwegian coast was almost unpopulated by the Norse, because this ecology was inhabited by the Sami, the native people of northern Sweden and large areas of Norway, Finland, and the Kola Peninsula in today's Russia. The Norse Scandinavians established polities and settlements in what are now Great Britain, England, Scotland, Wales, Ireland, Iceland, Russia, Belarus, France, Belgium, Ukraine, Finland, Estonia, Latvia, Lithuania, Germany, Poland, Greenland, Canada, and the Faroe Islands. See also Notes Out of convenience. Scandinavians is commonly used as a synonym for North Germanic peoples, even though Icelanders and Faroe Islanders do not inhabit Scandinavia today. The term is therefore given a cultural rather than geographical sense. <laughs>